putting out this first video to show you how to use zigzag i'll do another video on how to actually get everything set up if you haven't done it yet but for anyone who's already set up on zk sync already activated their wallet sent money over from layer one to uh to the zk sync wallet as you can see the first decentralized order book zigzag exchange on zk sync 1.0 has been live for three weeks last week 21.2 million in volume 60,000 in trades 5.96 say million saved in fees because it's cheaper than using layer one and 99.3 percent gas free reduction versus l1 using zk sync's atomic swap feature so it's based on atomic swaps and I believe that ZK Sync also tweeted that out. So it's kind of like nudging you, you know, they're letting you know, like, dude, test it out. Do yourself a favor and test it out. See, here you go. November 26th, they also tweeted it out. But <clears throat> I'm getting the link here from the Telegram and the pin message. So we're gonna go ahead and try it out. Now, it's decentralized. So I think you should be good even, hold on, even if you're in <clears throat> America, I think you should be okay. But I turned on my VPN just, just for the, just in case. Um, so it's decentralized order book. This kind of reminds me of the old Ether Delta from back in the day, if anyone remembers that. So here you go. Uh, what did they say? They said... Available pairs, ETH, USDC, ETH, USDT, USDC, and USDT. So, I uh, also have my wallet here. And I asked inside of the Discord, I had some questions. So, I was just asking just to answer the questions in case you have these questions. Hi, ZigZag, used on ETH L1 mainnet, or do I select ZK Rink to be? He said, this person said, I used ETH mainnet. Me too. Okay. I believe it should also work with Rinkaby testnet, though, not ZK Sync Rinkaby testnet. I said, okay, cool. Was the gas cheaper? Yep, for sure. You will have to pay a gas fee to activate your wallet, which I've already done, which I will cover um, in another video before you can do anything on ZK Sync, though. And that fee is based on L1 gas. You can check your wallet on zkscan.io to see if there's a change in public key entry. If there is, you have already paid the activation fee, which I already know I did. To give you an idea, I paid fees of 0.000326 ETH when I did one swap. Awesome, awesome. Did you use MetaMask or the ZK Sync wallet? To use ZigZag, you need to deposit ETH tokens from L1 to L2, which I have already done, into my ZK Sync wallet, and then use metamask to connect to zigzag website and trade your metamask will link up with your funds in wallet zk sync.io so there you go so you do it through metamask but you still have to have your zk sync wallet activated with funds in it and as you can see i have some usdc in there and what i'm going to do is i'm just going to trade from if to no from usdc to usdt so we go ahead, select that. Uh, well, first I need to connect my wallet. Okay. Uh, what's this here? Okay. All right, we're in. We are in there. Hold on, let me make sure I didn't connect to something else because I shouldn't have had to did that too many times. Wallet zinc zinc. Uh, let me disconnect from that. Disconnect from that. Disconnect from all of this right now. Okay, so I'm connected to zksync.io, which is another Unisync, which basically looks like um, a fork of Uniswap, basically. Okay, so anyway, we're still connected here to uh zk to zigzag and i guess you can put orders in here that's cool so hmm actually 
let's put an order in for some ETH. Uh, how's this gonna work? Oh yeah, we can do market. Fee says a dollar to trade. All right, let's limit orders disabled. Oh okay, so we can only do market orders right now. Okay, so we'll just do USDC to USDT then. Just to make some swaps here. Um, this is how much available USDT, no, USDC that I have. All right, we'll trade 126 dollars worth of USDC for some USDT and let's click the sell order pending sign or cancel we'll sign it so as you can see it is connected to my ZK sync wallet because that's how much I have in that wallet so let's sign Wow. Okay, so all you had to do was sign then. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Now I am... I'll just hold them both. I'll hold some USDC and USDT. And let's see if it's going to show. Yep, there it is. It popped up inside my ZK Sync wallet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. And it barely cost me any gas. How much? Let's see. History. Two days ago. Account activation. Discord, Twitter, and Telegram. Might as well join those as well. It's only right. So that's interesting. All right. That's interesting. I'm not showing the transaction history for the trade that I just made inside my wallet. Maybe it doesn't store in the wallet and it just stores here. There you go. So I don't know if that's going to change or not. We can view our transaction. If I'm going too fast, just watch this and have to speed. <laughs> All right. It says initiated, but it actually went through because I already have it in my wallet. So, and this is how much ethereum i spent to make the transaction so i guess it's my twitter i'm naked matrix i'll put it down below so we're doing the telegram you want to cover all your steps you want to cover all your steps okay metamask only does sign zk zinc doesn't use your metamask fund it uses the funds deposited probably means in my ZK sync wallet so it doesn't take any ETH so so zigzag just basically charges you straight from the funds that you have in your ZK sync wallet so what they charge you is the equivalent of this amount so how much is that roughly let's go to ETH you know coin gecko I was I've been using coin gecko since 2017 to figure these these amounts out okay paste take the ETH out of there so it cost me a dollar basically a dollar and seven cents just like it says on the website just like it says here on the exchange, it says it charges you a dollar, one dollar to trade. That's a beautiful, 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 beautiful thing.